LDN for interstitial cystitis, is it helpful and how would you dose it? Yes, um, seeing several people with interstitial cystitis, again, that's an inflammatory process. Low dose naltrexone, again, in very low doses, um, usually 4.5 or under has been very helpful. One thing I find with IC is that not everybody tolerates a 4.5 because of some gastrointestinal issues. So that's where a slow titration or a slow taper up would be a little more helpful. So in dosing that, you could start as low as maybe even 0.5 milligram and slowly increase maybe every seven to 14 days until the individual finds either their happy dose or 4.5 milligram. And then it would be dosed just once a day as well. So again, once a day, in my professional opinion, maybe start as low as half a milligram. And the reason why is because when we're dealing with interstitial cystitis, some people will flare if their hormones change and we always want to err on the side of caution. We want the provider, the prescriber to be the hero in this situation as well. So we, we always want to ensure that number one, we're looking out for patient safety and number two, that we've got that patient individually in mind so that we can work with them to find their sweet spot, their happy dose.